Hey everybody, I'm here today to talk to you about a Logitech keyboard that is not lighting up. These will be some easy fixes for that problem in this very simplistic tutorial. So once again, this will be an easy tutorial with easy fixes for the problem of a Logitech keyboard that is not lighting up. Let's get into this instructional video tutorial. So I'll be going over five easy fixes, um, and obviously this is not an illuminated keyboard. So I, you know, I'm just using this as an example for this video. Uh, but you know, your keyboard will obviously have lights enabled. This one does not. Okay. So let's get into this. So fix number one, the first thing that you should try to do and look at is to make sure the keyboard lights option is turned on within the keyboard itself. So physically make sure that the keyboard lights option is turned on on the keyboard. So on your keyboard, there's most likely going to be a button somewhere with regards to the keyboard lights option on the keyboard itself. And you want to make sure that it's turned on. That's the first thing that you got to do. Okay. That's obviously the most obvious thing, but make sure it's turned on. Okay. That's fix number one. Okay. If it's turned on and you know it's enabled, then move on to fix number two. Fix number two is to make sure the computer settings have the keyboard lights enabled and that's with regards to doing it digitally, okay? So on your computer settings, there's probably going to be some setting that will allow you to turn on or off the keyboard lights and maybe customize the lighting color. Make sure your computer settings have the keyboard lights enabled and that's a digital option. So the first one is physically on the keyboard and the second one is digitally on the computer. Make sure that you have the lights options enabled, okay? If that doesn't help you, I'll move on to fix number three. And fix number three is to unplug the keyboard from the computer and plug it back in. And that's obviously if it's a wired keyboard. So if you have a wired keyboard that is illuminated, you want to unplug the keyboard and plug it back in. It's an easy fix and you know, a lot of people overlook it, but believe it or not, you know, give it a try because it might just help you out and you can unplug it and also plug it back into a different USB port uh, as a secondary option to that fix right there. Okay. If that doesn't help you out, move on to fix number four. Fix and obviously, like I said, even if that's that sorry that that's if it's a wired um, if it's a wired keyboard, you can unplug it and plug it back in with the wire itself. But even if it's a wireless keyboard and you're using a dongle like this, unplug and plug back in that dongle and even try changing up the USB port uh, that the dongle is plugged into. So once again, that was for number three. Moving on to fix number four now. And fix number four is to replace the batteries with fresh ones if it's a wireless keyboard. So if it's a wireless keyboard, flip it over, okay, and replace the batteries with fresh ones, even if your keyboard is still working. Sometimes there's gonna be, there might be a glitch or a malfunction that if the batteries have a low charge, your keyboard will still work, but it, they won't have enough of a charge to illuminate the lights. So just replace the batteries with fresh ones if it's a wireless keyboard, try that out, okay? And if that doesn't help you, I'll move on to fix number five. And fix number five is to uninstall the keyboard driver and then reinstall it. So once again, fix number five is to uninstall the keyboard driver and then reinstall it. So your keyboard has a driver on the computer and that driver sort of uh, tells the keyboard and the computer how they interact essentially to, to sum it up into like layman's terms. You can uninstall the keyboard driver and then reinstall it. And that will hopefully, or even just try and update the keyboard driver if there's an updated version available. And that will hopefully solve the problem for you and get your keyboard to light up once again. And that's it. I tried to keep this video short and sweet and hopefully you liked it. If you enjoyed this video tutorial, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more good videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.